What is up everybody? Video Act here and I've got a special edition Loot Crate Call of Duty World War II. why I bought this. In all honesty, uh, I love Call of Duty. Don't get me wrong. But I bought the last Call of Duty and I literally never played it. Not once. I put it in. My PlayStation 4 told me said you needed to update. And I started the update. It was going to take hours. So I just let it run. Uh, two days later, I realized that my PlayStation was still on. I turned it on. Turned it off. And never turned it back on and <laughs> but this came available and I was like oh I love Call of Duty and I thought that I might buy the game and then kind of get back into it I never bought the game uh, never really even went back and tried to play the other one the previous one so really truly really, I think I just wasted money on this but it is what it is uh, We'll just get into it and see what it came with. Uh, if it would have came with a game, it would have been awesome. No, I'm not going to go buy it. Uh, I'm not going to buy it, probably. Anyway, this is it. This is the limited edition Call of Duty World War II by Loot Crate. All right. Nice. Got a pretty pimp-looking sweatshirt right there. We'll save that all for the last. Uh, got a little metal sign here. Fight for freedom. Call of Duty World War II. That's pretty cool. That's actually really neat. Um, I like that. I might put that in my deer stand or something. I put these little signs like this in my deer stand sometimes. If they're cool. That's actually, you know, America. I let me see. I got a limited edition Call of Duty World War II. Oh, this tells you everything that's in the thing. All right, cool. So, a propaganda sign. That's what that is. Alright, I got a Call of Duty deck of playing cards. I don't know. Oh, okay. So, it's got scenes from the game on the cards. Uh, I'm not going to open them up just because, but I just see. But... You know, playing cards, you never know when you'll need playing cards. Uh, Call of Duty pen, airborne pen, that's pretty cool. I like that a lot. Let me get it open, get it to where you can see it. That's pretty nifty. I actually like that. Cool deal. I have some infantry Call of Duty socks. And let's see what this is. This is. It looks like it might be a mug of some sort. It is a mug. It is a metal little mug. Like you might see in the movies. You see the guys sitting around drinking out of their mugs. Cool. Cool little mug. I like it. It would not be good to put anything hot in it probably because it would probably get very toasty. Just a little item. And last but no next to last would be this thing the anti-aircraft shell water bottle i think i've got a couple of these too <laughs> i'm pretty sure i do actually this is a smaller version of the ones that i have over there this is obviously branded for call of duty um yeah it's the exact same ones that i got over there that i got from some other boxes but pretty cool little deal uh definitely you know, I think it is. It's not double walled or nothing, but in a pinch, you want to throw something in there wet, it, it'll work for you. Pretty cool little deal. Um, not a big fan of them, and especially not the small one. So, cool. Cool, but not cool. I don't know. I don't know how you want to look at it. Now, last but not least, is the sweatshirt which I actually somewhat love because oh 
Yes. See, this is just something, and because they didn't overbrand it, it's perfect. You know, I mean, you wear it, and if it has Call of Duty written all over it, uh, it's just kind of, it's what it is. But this right here, this could just be, hey, I'm sporting a military sweatshirt. It's a full, you know, it's a, it's a full zip hoodie, man. I like it. Maybe Jen won't steal it. It's a little too big for Jen. <laughs> Might be a little too small for me. Nah, that's good. Cool, man. I like it. Man, that's warm, too. I like it. Very nice hoodie. Uh, pretty much makes up for the whole box. Uh, the box is okay, you know what I mean? It's nothing... I should have... I, I, I knew whenever I bought it that it was going to be kind of basic, I guess you would say. But at the same time, it's not bad. I can find something to do with this stuff, if uh, nothing else to give it away in a giveaway or use what I want. I don't know. I ordered it so long ago and finally I noticed that I went in to cancel a couple of loot crates, what is what happened. And I noticed that I had bought this and I was like, I never received that. So I sent them an email and I was like, hey, you know, I never received this. And they was like, oh, well, we're running a little behind. Should be going out this week. I was like, all right. And then like a couple days later, I got the shipping notice and it came in. So I'm very pumped about the hoodie, actually. I'm very excited about the hoodie, but everything else is kind of eh, whatever. But uh, that's it. That's all I got for you. That's the Call of Duty World War II uh, limited edition crate from Loot Crate. Um, I don't know if they have any still available, but you can check them out, lootcrate.com. I have a code that'll get you 10% off or five dollars off something like that that's it that's all i got for you tell me what you like tell me what you didn't in the comments below uh i thought it was pretty decent um like share comment all that fun stuff and subscribe because i'm out y'all have a good one